Good evening, graduates, families, and friends, and welcome to December commencement for North Park University 2022. What a journey you graduates have traveled in reaching this important milestone. We are delighted to celebrate with you and congratulate you on your perseverance. You have worked diligently to complete your degrees during a remarkable and challenging time in the history of our world. We are so proud of you. We give thanks to God for bringing us safely to this day. Now, graduates, we know that you did not do this alone, that your hopes and dreams fulfilled in part tonight are rooted in the support of those who love and encourage you, the parents, family members, faculty members, and friends who have helped you reach this tremendous milestone. Let's take this moment to stand and turn and find those faithful champions who have joined you here tonight, and let's offer them a round of applause for their support. And now I invite you to join me in seeking God's blessing over our evening together. Let us pray. Lord Jesus, for these precious graduating students of North Park University and North Park Theological Seminary, we give you thanks. They have worked so hard. You have guided and protected them, and tonight you are the center of our joy and celebration. Almighty God, fountain of all wisdom, through your Holy Spirit, you enlighten those who teach and those who learn, so that rejoicing in the knowledge of your truth, we may worship you and serve you from generation to generation. Tonight, we offer this ceremony of completion and commencement to you as a time of thanks and praise for all that has been accomplished and all that is yet to come. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen.
A reading from the book of Ephesians, chapter 2, verses 4 through 10. But because of his great love for us, God, who is rich in mercy, made us alive with Christ, even when we were dead in transgressions. It is by grace you have been saved. And God raised us up with Christ and seated us with him in the heavenly realms in Christ Jesus, in order that in the coming ages he might show the incomparable riches of his grace expressed in his kindness to us in Christ Jesus. For it is by grace you have been saved through faith. And this not from yourselves, it is the gift of God, not by works so that no one can boast. For we are God's handiwork, created in Christ Jesus to do good works, which God prepared in advance for us to do. Dear graduates, it is my privilege to offer you a brief charge upon your graduation. The charge to the graduates expresses our final word of encouragement to you, and it sets out our hopes and expectations for you as you leave your campus home, become alumni of North Park, and embark on the very essential work that God has prepared for you to do. This is, of course, a bittersweet moment for us as we prepare to say goodbye. We cannot presume to know all of the paths that you will travel or the opportunities that you will grasp, but we can offer the assurance that you are very well prepared. You have demonstrated your willingness to work very hard, to immerse yourselves in an environment of life and work in the multi-ethnic community of North Park, valuing and embracing your own culture and identity while uplifting and honoring your classmates and theirs, achieving collaborative success together and individual achievement of your own. Now it will be up to you to take hold of what comes next. At our Christian university in this world-class city, we have the freedom and the gift to turn to scripture as a guide and encouragement in all that we do. Tonight, as we prepare to depart from each other, we can take our lead from the passage included in our ceremony and the vital truth about just who you are. From Ephesians, read just moments ago, you are God's handiwork, his artistry, his workmanship, uniquely you, created in Christ Jesus and prepared to do the good work that God has prepared for you to do. God's handiwork, his very best and unique work. With all of the gifts and the talents that you have to offer the world, your life's path included your years and experiences here at North Park, and he has prepared for you the next good work for you to do too. Tonight we offer an encouragement to hold in your mind and in your heart in the months and years to come with all of the joy and the pain the bewilderment and accomplishment that will certainly come with your abundant life. The encouragement is simply this, always remember who you are. You are God's workmanship, his handiwork, his artistry. The Greek word for workmanship is poema, from which we derive the English words poem and poetry. Have you ever thought of your life's work as divine poetry? Well, it most certainly is. You are God's masterpiece, a work of art, custom made to be one of a kind, and your life is developing and unfolding as a work of art. Author Kent Hughes notes that Michelangelo was once asked what he was doing as he chipped away at a shapeless piece of marble. He replied, well, I'm liberating an angel from this piece of stone. That's what God is doing with us. We are the handiwork of the maker. You are described in Psalm 139 as the one who is fearfully and wonderfully made. And now you are prepared and poised for the purpose that you are to fulfill. And you are the one who also holds God's promise, the promise that he will be your companion in all times. When you're celebrating 
he'll be your champion in joy. When you're in the depths, he'll be your friend in sorrow. You can cling to him when times are dark because darkness is as light to him and he promises to overcome it. He'll go with you to the far sides of the city and the far sides of the world. Remember, you're his poetry, his handiwork, his best and unique work. During your days at North Park, you strengthened into the person you are today through joys, many challenges, but the lasting relationships that you encountered and engaged. Relationships with your faculty members who have walked alongside you, walked the road of learning and mentoring, investing in you and encouraging you, listening to you and supporting you, challenging you to grow and strengthen in every part of your life and advocating for you every step of the way. They care deeply about you. Stay in touch with them because they are equally interested in what comes next. Your successes will be celebrated and your pains will be shared. They are your true champions. Stay connected also to your lifelong friends and partners you've been blessed to meet and know and love. These are your people. You have shared many sacred days and these are the friends who will want to share everything that comes next. Remember your coaches and conductors and roommates and suite mates and workmates and teammates. These are the most valuable memories and relationships that will mark your North Park life. And tomorrow, the next marvelous step begins. The work that God has prepared in advance for you to do. The work that only you can do in the unique way that you will do it. Just as he made you, he's called you. And just as he has called you, he has likewise equipped you. You will have that life of significance and service that you will lead. And you are so very needed in our city and in our world today. As you step into your professions and your families, your people and your communities of faith, remember who you are, God's artistry, his masterpiece, wonderfully made, prepared in this diverse and devoted community. You are a graduate of North Park University and you are ready to love and serve and lead. December class of 2022, congratulations. You are ready, go for it. We love you. Good evening. Joining me on stage is Dr. Lisa Ann Acosta, University Dean, and it is our pleasure to present this year's recipient on the Anfelt Medallion. The Anfelt Medallion is named in honor of Alfred Nelson Anfelt, North Park's first professor who was acting president when the colleges were added to the seminary shortly after the turn of the century. The Anfelt Medallion is presented to the traditional four-year student with the highest grade point average in their class. This year, we have a student who has graduated with a 4.0 GPA. I'd like to invite Zoha Raza to the stage at this time. She's not getting off easy. We're going to talk about her as she's on stage. We asked her faculty and professors to share some remarks about the gifts of Zoha, and this is her, their remarks. She graduates today with a 4.0 and a Bachelor of Arts in History and Philosophy. Throughout her time at North Park, Zoha has enlightened the minds and challenged the intellects of those around her. The insights she contributes in any conversation are strong and clear, and she is always open to learning more from her fellow students and professors. The spirit she brings to her studies, her curiosities, and her passions is a, are a delight to hold. Her relentless pursuit of wisdom elevates any classroom discussion, and we are all better off that she has been a part of our community here at North Park. Any winner of this medallion is not only capable of excelling in their specialty, their major, but also in a wide range of core curriculum classes across the disciplines. It is the award given to our students who truly excel in the breadth a liberal arts education offers. 
Zohan's achievement is so well deserved because she brought the same pursuit of truth and a passion for justice to each of our classes. She balanced her commitments to work, family life, classes, and leadership in campus clubs in a truly remarkable way. She is one of the finest students I've worked with. She is endlessly curious, a fine critical thinker, intellectually disciplined, and integrative in her thinking. She is unusually capable of bringing perspectives from a variety of disciplines to bear on her questions. Though she is a history and philosophy major, her breadth of learning is much greater. She's deeply interested in questions of religion. What is striking is that her questions and pursuits are rooted not only in her head, but in her heart. This is the true definition of intellect, bringing the insights of learning to bear on ethical issues and actions. When Zoha took her capstone seminar in history last year, she was deeply affected by the course subject matter. She was especially concerned to find ways in which she could use her learning and skills to help others and to make a real difference in the world. She even asked to continue meeting for these discussions after the formal classes had ended. Every professor she has worked with will say the same things about Zoha. She's an extraordinary young woman of great gifts and conscience with whom it's been an honor to work. In the end, I can simply say that Zoha embodies the best of North Park University and her faculty are grateful to have the opportunity to be her teacher. Please help me in congratulating Anfelt Medallion recipient Zoha Reza.
Madam President, on behalf of the faculty of North Park University, I have the pleasure to present the members of the graduating class of 2022. These students have been approved by the faculty of North Park University for graduation, and we now present them to you for conferral of their degrees. You have been diligent in your studies and have attained the requirements stipulated for your respective academic degree. You have affirmed the mission and the spirit of this university. With the affirmation of the faculty, by the authority of the Board of Trustees, and an exercise of the powers granted by the State of Illinois, as President of North Park University, it is my privilege to confer upon you the academic degree which you have attained with all of the rights, privileges, and honors appertaining to that degree. Graduates, you may present yourselves for your diplomas. President Surridge, Provost Carr, family and friends of our graduates, on behalf of the faculty and staff of the College of Arts and Sciences, I, Dean Dr. Peter Keith Bennett St. Jean, have the honor of presenting the following December 2020 candidates for Bachelors of Arts and Bachelors of Sciences. Stephanie Jacqueline Bello. Audrey Lalini Borden. Kitlin Louise Chess. Andreas C. Fuentes. Ryan Clary. Anstilotti De Luzma. Lisa Amid. Denka Lalina Denkin Duncan Punam Dulal Kara H. Arahimi Oswaldo Espanosa. Emma Victoria Philipson. Lydia Frostberg. Sandra Victoria Emilia Fred. Brandon Gaitan Price Maloyad Greer Asra Jawani Andrew Jordan Johnson Mohammed Anas for Akmiya Kadri. Sophie Kennedy. Linda Michelle Kozak. (laughs) 
Apple May Labar. Montserrat Labato. Deja K. McBroom. Jacqueline Rose Mendro. Mylan Linda Wynn. Samuel V. Public. Dhruvi Patel. Raya Patel. Madeline Grace Paul. Karina Pena. Andra Rossum. Zoa Fatima Raza. Samuel Robert Rolla Stevens. Marco M. Serrano. Giselle Tapia. Itzel Alejandra Villar. Harlem Masimba West Hammond. John P. Yokohana. President Surridge and Provost Carr, on behalf of the faculty and staff of the School of Business and Nonprofit Management, it is my honor to present the following candidates for bachelor degrees in business. Renar Berg Domas. <laughs> William Bostrom Ridville. Hannah Callahan. <laughs> Stanislav Eslikowski. Lydia Forsberg. William Ilya Getz. Wafa Hattop. Noel Holm. Anthony S. Martinez. Stephen McCree. Michelle Mesa. Madeline Grace Paul. Rafael Milan Richard. 
Almas Threesick. Christopher Baez. Naomi Vanessa Fasciani. Cesar Esho Jabayalda. Brian Zatina. Madam President, Provost Carr, it is my honor to present to you the graduates for the Bachelor's of Arts degrees for the Stu School of Education. Ryan P. Cleary. Gazelle Tapia. President Surridge, Provost Carr, family and friends of our graduates, on behalf of the faculty and staff of the School of Music, Art, and Theater, it is my honor to present the following December 2022 candidates for the Bachelor of Arts in Art, Bachelor of Arts in Music, and Bachelor of Music Education degrees. Veronica Chopley. January 2. Jacqueline Rose Mendro. Daria Monique Velasquez. Madam President, Provost Carr, it is my honor to present to you the graduates for the bachelor's degree from the School of Nursing and Health Sciences. <laughs> Natalie Marie Amaro. <laughs> Vanessa D. Avia. <laughs> Alexandra Bonilla. Wendy Nicole Cajas. Hoi Jong Choi. Demarius Cifuentes. Nicole Odalise Cruz. Sinaida Jaco. Maya Edelmuth. Kathleen Flores. Robert A. Gardner. Katrina Anne Marie Giannoni. David Gong. Almadina Habul. Caleb Hacker. Nicole Amanda Hansen. Matilda Yardstrom. Sung Min Kim. Samantha Kalasik. Jumi Lee. Jill R. Lee Luke. Ronaldo Elias Lopez. Ola 
Ola Latatska. Mary Malconian. Juliana Padilla. Hilda Parau. Rhea Patel. Ryland Pence, Andrea Perez, Andrea Pimentel, Serena Hope Polikas, Tula Kureshi. Andreas Yelly Racket. Jacqueline Rapp. Herbert Reyes. Servand Raymond Rizari. Adriana Elizabeth Robles. Maria Ronstadt. Joanna Salgado. Steve Salinas. Everton Edamar Schooneman, Frederico Shiro, yes! Michelle Skarzinski. Leah Abby Sopt, Ruth Cynthia Sopt, Bader Sophie, Tina T. Churong. Yeah. Evelyn Vidal Robles. President Surridge, Provost Carr, family and friends of our graduates, on behalf of the faculty and staff of the School of Professional Studies, I have the honor of presenting the December 2022 candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Arts. Angela K. Baldwin. J. Shivko Bullough. Theodore Gamel III. Shaton Hill. Janice Mercado. Brittany Pettinger. Nicholas C. Pion. Kyle Robertson. Ignacio Rodriguez.
Ross Ruley. Jose Rodolfo Vasquez. President Surridge and Provost Carr, on behalf of the faculty and staff of the School of Business and Nonprofit Management, it is my honor to present the following candidates for master's de degrees. Naziba Khan Ashwanova. <clears throat> Yancy Kawe. <clears throat> Julian A. Gonzalez. Kristen A. Gordon. Swathi Gudla. Jill Renee Hawkinson. Anita Johnson. Madison Brilivia. Kirsch, Emily Claire Kornack, Ralitza Cortiva, Victor Lubitsky, Anna Maria Lazoya. Ulrich Elior Lund. Bradley Michael Maurer. Susan Rudiger Mishabcheb. Jocelyn Michelle Moreno. Emily Sajan Pachilamakil. <laughs> Malcolm W. Parker. <laughs> Eric Perez. <laughs> Katie L. Pratt. Gabriel Sandoval. Vanessa D. Talaferro. Mandy Hurst Valdez. Jean Valerie Lennon Valoria. Emily Jo Ward. Bridget A. Works Mavon. Madam President, Provost Carr, it is my honor to present to you the graduates for the Master of Arts degree from the School of Education. Shailene Alanis. Brian M. Alvarez. Amanda L. Barud. <clears throat> C. 
Sally P. Kedmeshin. Peter Anthony Casella. Alana R. Davidoff. Claire Elaine Durwood. Nicole L. Godal. Michelle Gonzalez. Barry D. Hager. Stephanie J. Horberg. Jenny Toller Huffman. Vincent Frank Judita. Kevin Michelle Lor Mata. Alisa Lopez. Maritza Marie Martinez. Jessica McDonald. Anthony John Myosik. Jacques Moses. Bianca Mariah Munez. Tan Nguyen. Ruby Orozco. Lawrence T. Prentice. Sahar Salome. Mark Taddeus Schwarz. Susan Shaba. Scott Venus. Sarah Wayne. Mary Ashore Warda. Zachary Brian Yeager. Ugo Zarate. From the School of Music, Art, and Theater, it is my honor to present the following candidates for the Master of Music in Vocal Performance. Catherine Elizabeth Larson. Diana Rose Monticelli. Madison Helene Petrozewski. Madam President and Provost Carr, it is my honor to present to you the graduates of the Masters of School of Nursing. All right, Corny Batista. Beata Barbara Binsky. 
Patrick Crow. Mary M. Cunningham. Danielle Noel Del Friero. Ron Kyle Medina. Ashante Norris. Dolly Day Kiamko. Robin T. Rutherford. Corey Andrew Shrewberry. Maria Rosario Shunk. Cynthia Maria Vitulis. Hina Rain Villani. Mary Isabella Viella Espinoza. Madam President, Provost Carr, it is my honor to pre present to you the graduates for the doctoral degree from the School of Nursing and Health Sciences. <laughs> Dr. Mary Sheehan, hooding Dr. Eva Kritokis Lefcetis. Dr. Mary Sheehan Hooding, Natalia Elizabeth Marsikowski. President Suras, Provost Carr, on behalf of the faculty and staff of the School of Professional Studies, I have the honor of presenting the December 2022 candidates for the Master of Arts degree in Clinical Mental Health Counseling. <laughs> Rishma Antony. Dana Fenceroy. Jamie Ellen Gray. Tori Lanise Hairston. Stephanie Hernandez. Christian Johnson. Bori Kim. <laughs> Megan McDaniel. Tanya Pashkuleva. <laughs> Patrick Brian Robido. <laughs> Lucas Soma. Peter K.B. St. Jean. Sarah Azriel Stiglitz. Lynette Tsunsum.
Mary B. Troop. Robin Wilson. Madam President, it is my honor to present to you the graduates for the master's degree from North Park Theological Seminary. Christopher John Kelly. Emily Ann Seiler. Ladies and gentlemen, let's offer one big round of applause for the graduating class of December 2022. So voy a leer de número 6, 24 al 26. Y dice, Jehová te bendiga y te guarde. Jehová haga resplandecer su rostro sobre ti y, te de de, y tenga de ti misericordia. Jehová alce sobre ti su rostro y ponga en ti paz. Jehová no te bendiga Yawakeso Noege Jabiwa Une Pepushkir Wanhanura. Yawakeso Injaege Norul Injahage Norul Paraboshimyo Noege Pyonganil Chushikir Wananura. Pagpalain ka nawa at ingata ni Yawe. Kahabagan ka nawat subay bayan ni Yawe. Lingapin ka nawa at bigyan ng kapayapaan ni Yawe. Ganito nila babanggitin ang pangalan ko sa pagbabasbas sa mga Israelita at yak ngang pagpapalain ko sila. Baruch loch Maria unatayroch, mabher Maria pathu illoch umraham illoch, more Maria pathu illoch uyawiloch shlama. Нехай Господь благословить тебе і охороняє тебе. Нехай Господь світить тобі лицем своїм і виявить тобі свою доброту. Нехай Господь посміхнеться тобі і дасть тобі мир. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace.
class of 2022. You did it. Congratulations again. Yeah. Please join me in a word of prayer as we give thanks to God, followed by a benediction. Let us pray. God, we give you thanks for these graduates tonight. We ask that you would keep their footsteps firm and remind them that you are with them always. May they sense your presence of your spirit over their lives. God, may you strengthen them with hope, even in challenging and unclear moments in life. May your blessings follow them as they find new journeys to travel. May you walk along with them. God, may your gentle hand guide the decisions that they will make and the passions that they have to follow. May their hearts and lives always reflect your love and truth. And may hope be a light within them that they carry into this world each and every day. God, may they pour out their gifts and talents to bless others, to, to pay it forward. May they hold this memory in their hearts as they continue on their journey. We ask these things and blessings in the name of Christ our Lord. Amen. And if you're able to stand, please stand and receive this benediction. Class of 2022, as you go and you leave this place, go out with joy as you celebrate your achievement here tonight. Go out with confidence knowing that the God of love will lead and guide your ways. Go out in unity, take your gifts and talents and give them to the world. Go out with strength, clothed and equipped with all that you've learned here at North Park. Go out with wisdom as God renews your mind each and every day. Go as bearers of hope and love to live in the light of God's good purposes for your life and the lives of others. And lastly, go in peace. And all of God's people said, amen.